Hello believers and welcome to this episode of SMC DAO tutorial. Today, I will be giving you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to perform a P2P transaction on OKX. P2P is a short form of pair-to-pair -pair, and it's simply a market where you can buy or sell your cryptocurrency for fiat. So let's get right into it. I'll tap right here on my OKX app, which you can get from your Play Store or from your App Store. So this is the homepage of your OKX app and it shows you the total value of USDT that you currently have in your OKX exchange. Mm -hmm. One thing that's important to note is that if you are selling your USDT for Naira, tap right there on your assets. The overview gives you a total summation of how much is in your three wallets. By three wallets, I'm referring to your funding wallet, your trading wallet, and your grow wallet. Now, it's important that you transfer the amount of USDT that you want to sell from your trading wallet into your funding wallet. And you can easily do that by tapping on transfer. And you'd see from trading to funding, the asset is USDT and you put in the amount of USDT that you want to sell to transfer into your funding wallet could be 12 it could be 120 it could be 1200 or however much you have tap right there on max if you want to send all the usdt that is in your trading wallet and confirm and it immediately goes into your funding wallet all right so once you have noticed that you have transferred your money from your trading wallet into your funding wallet you are now ready to sell your USDT for Naira. All right, so let's go right back to our homepage of OKX and tap right there on P2P trading. And it brings us into the P2P market to see what it is like. Remember I said that P2P market or pair-to-pair -pair market is where you can sell your USDT or your cryptocurrency for fiat or vice versa. One of the things to note in the peer-to-peer -peer market is that the most favorable prices are always up, whether in the buy channel or in the sell channel. If you tap on the buy channel, it means that you want to convert your Naira into USDT. If you tap on the sell channel, it means you want to convert your USDT into naira so for example today i want to sell ten thousand naira worth of my usdt into my bank account number all these people are vendors all these prizes are given by vendors and their names are right up there one thing you have to check before you buy or sell from any vendor is the completion rate the completion rate lets you know how fast and how efficient each vendor is one with a higher completion rate is more favorable now remember that i said that the best prices or the most favorable prices are up on the sell channel best prices for buying since it's important to always buy low will be up and the more expensive prices will be all the way down so if you want to buy or sell always get the price that is above above the other one if you want to sell 10,000 naira worth of usdt to naira to your bank account you have to check the order limit this person sells only from 1 million naira up to 3.3 million naira the next vendor sells from 5 million to 27 million naira so i want to sell only 10,000 naira worth of my usdt to be able to find someone that goes within my order limit someone that would be able to sell up to 10k for me i'd have to scroll all the way down and the lower you want to buy the lower you scroll the lower the prices become which means the more unfavorable the prices become once i find a vendor within my order limit i tap right there on sell and put in the amount of usdt that i want to sell which would be 6.5 which should be around 10,000 naira worth 
tap right there on sell with zero fees and this page appears so once the vendor has sent the money into my account i would see this release crypto sign which means that he has sent the money into my account so i would go to my bank account check and confirm that this amount was transferred to me and only when you have confirmed then you can tap on release crypto if you haven't confirmed please don't tap on release crypto so that you would not lose your funds so since i have confirmed that he has transferred my money to me i tap right there on release crypto and confirm that i have received the full amount and agree to release the crypto tap again release crypto it shows me that i have officially sold 6.50 usdt and you can view it in your assets and you'd see that your your okx wallet has reduced by 6.50 usdt in the same way if you want to buy your usdt you can go back to the p2p page p2p market and tap on the buy channel choose the most favorable price within your order limits and tap on buy and buy 20,000 naira worth of usdt which is worth 12.84 usdt and tap on buy with zero fees all right so you can copy the order id in case of disputes or any issue that could arise which is most unlikely tap on get payment details copy the account number note the bank name and the account name so that you don't transfer to a wrong person copy the account number and go to your bank account and pay in the money however it's important to note the payment time of this vendor which is 15 minutes i have already used up to three minutes by now so go to your bank app and pay in the money so once i have paid in the money to this account which i have done i'll tap on i have paid and put in the proof of payment all right so when you have uploaded the proof which is uploading the screenshot of the receipt of the transaction tap right there on confirm payment then you can remind the seller tap on remind the seller if it takes too much time just tap on remind the seller so once the seller has received and confirmed this payment he will transfer 12.84 usdt into my wallet and then the order is complete so this is a simple process on how to buy or sell usdt on the pair to pair market so it shows that the seller has received payment and the orders are all the order is completed which means that i have received my 12.8 usdt into my wallet Right, so this that is a simple video on how to buy and sell usdt by yourself on your okx wallet exchange so try this out try to buy your usdt or try to sell your usdt or any other cryptocurrency using this method that i have shown you if this video has been of help to you tap right there and like it subscribe and turn on post notifications to be the first to get any of our tutorial videos that we release. See you in our next video. Goodbye.